Okay, well, the camera quit. It rebooted, the whole phone rebooted, so we're starting a new video. Now we're going to blow out the, uh, this is, so I'm replacing my water inlet valve on my freezer, my Whirlpool. I never did say it was a Whirlpool. Um, I'm trying to figure out if there's a place I can set this thing. the general area. I don't know if I can leave that tray in there and get to it or not. I really didn't want to take the tray out, but it's spot melting. It's full of ice. Handmade ice instead of automated. So I think I'm going to have to. So let me... I don't want to set it in the heat out in the garage. Let me put this back this way. you'll see but I gotta do that. Keeps leaking. I didn't could have shown that. I didn't think about it. But it keeps. There's the ice maker. But it keeps leaking down in the wall and down the all into the all of this stuff down here. It's got ice cubes, icebergs on it. I mean, you can't get this stuff out of there. Hard. I don't have any tools with me right now. I, need to bring them. I just want to get it to where that'll go back in there. It's amazing. I'm not going to blow it, I'm just going to see if I can use a knife pick. There we go. It's the only thing I had with me. That's what I was planning on using. I'm not going to try to get it all out right now. I just want to try to get the thing fixed and working. When we get to the back of the refrigerator, you want those breakfast things out. 